How's it going guys? Goki here to bring you episode 1 of the series, The Whitetail Hunt. In this series, we'll be starting from scratch working our way up to hunt potential diamond whitetail bucks. Make sure to like and subscribe and for future episodes, click the post notification box down below. Let's start the hunt. I want to get a good shot on her. Oh, I don't want to mess this up. Uh, not gonna, she's not going to turn either. Let me see if I can call her in. She turned. Gentle now. Take a deep breath to steady your aim. Alright, so we're gonna pop her whenever we get a good shot on her. She should stop somewhere around here. There. Okay. Use your binoculars to get a closer look. Yeah, let's get a little bit of XP on there. Oh, she turned straight on to us. That's just horrible. Be sure to aim for its vital organs. Heart and lung shots mean quicker kills. I feel Less like I should painful. drop her, right? That should be a heart shot. Wow. Okay, so first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna upgrade this gun. That's just that's just ridiculous. That should be a dead deer. Back close, that shot, it should be a dead deer. So first thing we're gonna do, um, I got some DLCs and we're gonna we're gonna upgrade to a better gun. Maybe a two seventy, maybe a thirty oh six, depending on what we can get with the money we have. There are times when you'll want to be moving fast out here, but not when on a hunt. The animals will hear you coming a mile away. Alright, so we're gonna take all the money we can get right now. Hey, you're catching on quickly. Um, it's the best the best thing we can do right now. We don't have money, we don't have uh, XP, so we can't level up our things. Um so right now we're gonna we're gonna start our adventure. This is pretty much what we're doing here. We're gonna start our adventure for the white tailed deer hunt. Alright, so we lost the white tail, lost our tracks, can't find them anywhere. So we're gonna go straight to um a watchtower. We're gonna claim that, get a house, and we'll move on from there. Upgrade our weapons, of course. And we'll start our, our adventure. Alright, so we made it for, to the first outpost. Or to the first um, watchtower. We're going to claim it and we're going to get a house. Change our weapons, change it. Whatever we can. Maybe get a bow in, because I'm a big fan of bow hunting in this game. So, uh, we'll see if we can hunt some animals with, with a bow. It'd be a lot nicer. Would you look at that view? Never gets old, I'm telling you. From up here, you can see a lot of great hunting spots in the area. Valmont's not only where Hope set up camp, it's also famous for the railroad bridges along the old North Pacific line. Right. Keep an eye out for them if you can in between blacktail hunting. Or, why not use them as vantage points? I once bagged a whitetail from the Runaki Bridge. All right, so we Be sure to stop by one of the outposts. You can find pretty much anything you need there. Alright, so we're going to go straight to the house. To the outpost. We're going to claim it. And, uh... Then we'll start the, the adventure of whitetail hunting. Okay. So we made it to the outpost. We're going to claim it. 
and then we're going to uh, we're going to change your gun. Nice place, right? You won't find a soft bed in many parts around here. Don't forget to stock up before heading out. So for our primary gun, we're going to be using the 306. We have 40 rounds with it, and it's a great deer hunting gun. Our secondary will be the shotgun for any small game animals. It also has buckshot in it. And our third gun will be the 270, good for deer, moose, pretty much anything you can put your mind in. So we're gonna we're gonna drive to a decent spot and try that out. I'm gonna go over here to the corner, and we'll see how everything's looking. And hopefully there's some kind of group of deer, white-tailed deer hunting there. So we're hoping there's a deer on the other side of this bridge to start off the, the evening, or to start off the day. And uh, hopefully we can end this episode with something good. Okay, well there's nothing here. Alright, so we're going to go straight to the outpost, to the next outpost. We're going to get grab that house and... Um, And we'll set the time. There, there's a group of deer here. It's just hold on, there's a group of deer. I didn't even see them. It doesn't look like there's anything big though. It just looks all like females, two females riding around or walking around. We're probably gonna take one just because we need the, the money. So let's grab that 270 or 36. Oof. Another one here. That's a buck. We're gonna take a buck for sure. Okay. Let's see if we can grab this buck. We'll probably get a little closer too. He doesn't see us or anything like that. We're pretty decent. Yeah, we're gonna take him. Uh, looks like a. It's a white toe. Very small white tail, but we can definitely take him. Especially with the 270 or the 306. Alright, so we're gonna take him whenever she moves. She just got right in the way. Maybe we can get both? Mm, highly doubt it. Alright, let's see if we can get a little closer. We'll take we'll take both shots. Maybe we can get them both. Maybe not. I don't know. He's... <sighs> Alright. Alright, so we're gonna... We're gonna get a little closer. Um, until we get a better scope, we're gonna have to take our shots a little bit closer. So we're gonna take a shot at this big one. That's enough waiting. And... It didn't give us enough time to get the other one. I don't have the. What's that? We don't have a. Um, we don't have the. The walk on reload yet, so that's one of the first things we're gonna do. We're gonna upgrade that. But so for now, we're just gonna take that one, and we'll get to the outpost after we grab him. Wherever he was. White-tailed deer are often slightly bigger than the black tail, but they're quicker to flee if they sense danger. Wow, you can't even see him. All right, so there's our first white-tailed deer. The little silver, nice lung shot. We found our first spot though. This is a feeding ground for white-tailed deer. So whenever we get a chance, we'll come back. We'll set a tripod. I think I got three of them for now. Until we get a little bit more money, I'll buy another one, and we'll we'll set a, a tripod and a tent around here. We made it to the next outpost. 
we're gonna claim it and walk the river see if we can find another group of white-tailed deer While searching for groups of deer, we ran into a black bear and decided to take a shot on him. We needed the money, so I decided to also take a couple ducks with us. So we ran into our first group of white tail. Looks like a pretty decent one. There's a nice buck there. Also a nice buck there. I'm gonna call them over, see what see if we can get them out. And get a better shot on them. Definitely would like to take that shot on on this one in the back. He's he's very big looking. He looks nice. So does the one on the back. I'm not exactly sure which one's bigger. to say the one on the back looks a little bigger, right? I would think. Yeah, he's... They're both very nice. Let's see if we can get them both. We have 30 of six. We're going to try to get them both down. We dropped him. That's him over there. He's big. I definitely hit him pretty good. He's hurt. He's down. He's falling. Wow. Okay. You gonna go down? Should I take another shot? I don't wanna mess him up. I'm gonna let him drop. He's now he runs. Alright. Wait, is he coming back? Yeah, definitely gonna get a good shot on him, but we knocked one down, so it's a little bit of extra money. We got another feeding ground around here. Which is great. He stopped. Ugh. That's another one. Alright, so we got our first decent sized buck to start off the day. We got a, our first gold. First gold with a single long shot. Nice buck. And there's another deer over here. Check him out really quick. Depending on him, it's a doe. Okay. We're gonna look for for the other male. Oh, I feel like that's important. Um, I definitely give him a shot somewhere somewhere around here. We're gonna chase him down. See if we can find any blood anywhere. He would have been down if I hit him good, so I definitely didn't hit him where I wanted. No vital organ hit. But he should be dead by now. He would have been a silver potential. Um, not too crazy. So, we didn't ruin him too much. 
Got a little bit of money out of it. A little bit less than what we wanted, but still got a good deer out of it. It was a good hunt. Remember to like and subscribe. I will be posting episode 2 of the series tomorrow. So click that post notification button down below so you'll be notified when the video is up. Till next time.